Alright, welcome back to another CTR Nitro Fueled video and today I'm doing something I haven't done before on the channel. I think I've created around 150 CTR videos already, but I have never done a final skin episode on a character. And because Beanox are only adding one character every single Grand Prix, I will do this for every new character that's gonna be coming out. Right now, we are showcasing the final skin for Mega Mix, the Nightmare Mega Mix skin, and he looks absolutely insane. He's all purple, and I matched him up with the purple cart and the purple paint job, um, the purple wheels. He is just all purple, man, and in my opinion, it is one of the best alternative skins on the game. He just looks insane. Mega Mix has become one of my favorite characters especially because of this skin right here so we are going to showcase that in this episode. Before I do that I gotta go through the comment of the day section and the first comment comes from Epel Vosh. I'm only going to read the first bit of his comment because I think that's really really interesting what he says right here. He says hello from the Dingo Dial on Papu's Pyramid. It is interesting to see the race from a different perspective and the difference peer-to-peer -peer connections provide. Notably for you, I appeared to be racing with the Dusty Rider card when I was actually using the Nuke. Anyway, a good race. Yeah, you beat me fair and square in that race. I remember being really unlucky because of that warp orb and you just had the shield up. So that was just really unlucky from me. But really good race though, but it's really interesting to see that you were actually racing with a different loadout than appeared on my screen. At the start of the race, I was also in first place, but in your perspective, I actually saw you were in first place as well, so it's it's weird. The peer-to-peer -peer connection is weird sometimes in this game. Anyway, and the second comment comes from Steven was taken, and he says, What program do you use for your thumbnails? I don't use Photoshop or any Adobe uh, program, I just use GIMP. It's a free software that I use to create my thumbnails. I've been using it ever since I started YouTube. Um, I think I'm already doing YouTube for seven years and I've been using GIMP ever since I started. It's a really good program. Once you get used to it, it's really easy to create thumbnails. So definitely try it out if you want to make some yourself. Anyway, we are going to jump into an online lobby here um, and just talk about, uh, talk about this skin here. This is an amazing skin, man. And the cart as well. It's one of my favorite carts. It's just so perfect for the Rustland Grand Prix with the spikes. It, it really makes him look more terrifying than he already is. Um, oh, Cortex Castle. It's been a while since I've raced on, uh, on Cortex Castle though, so I really want to do that. And it took me a while to unlock this skin as well, because if you guys didn't know, I always race online. I never... Uh, really play races um, offline, so I get all these wins. I think you need 25 wins or 20 wins to get this skin, and I do them all um, online. So that is why there might be a delay on um, on these uh, on these videos, uh, just because I'm trying to get the final skin for for the character. Um, anyway, it is going to be Cortex Castle, though I am already hyped for it. Let's just jump right into it. You guys can always let me know if you already unlocked the final version of Mega Mix, uh, because it is really hard to do. And let me know if you do it in the online section or if you also play uh, play some offline races to uh, to get the skin. Cortex Castle, though, really really difficult to keep the blue flame on this track. Oh boy, yo, this dude, get out of here, bro. Oh yes, I hit him. There we go. Now keep the sacred fire, man. We're already building up a lead. Oh, that one is perfect. That boost is just perf- Oh no, yeah. Well, it's perfect for now, I guess. Because we need to get this shortcut right, and we did. And now it's all up to uh, maintaining the blue flames here. Still pretty bad at U-turning. And I bumped the wall. I am such an idiot, bro. I'm not performing. 
not performing well. Yeah, the guy still has the blue flames. Just, just as I said, it's really difficult to keep them. Even the guy in third has the blue flames still. Oh, I should not have used this uh, the shield yet. Come on. Oh, we lost the blue flames though. If we can keep it next round, we might be in for a uh, for a victory. Or if there's a warp orb coming or something. I really want to warp orb now. Okay, focus up, Neil. Focus up a little bit. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Come on. No! Man, I always lose it right here. Wait, we are really close to him. Oh, come on. Oh, man. If I, if I could have kept it a little bit longer, that would have been so good. But right now, I don't think we're gonna get it. Nah. He got the shortcut as well. Good race, though. Really good race. Wait, he got hit! Oh my god, he got hit! He got hit by the spider. Oh, that was the luckiest finish I've ever seen on this game. <laughs> I really thought I was gonna end up uh, second here, but oof, man, he uh, he failed. I think he got hit by a bot as well. Man, that must feel bad. Oh, there we go. It looks even better seeing him with the nightmare Mega Mix skin on top of the podium. He just looks so terrifying, man. Beanox really did a great job with this uh, with this skin here. Coco Park. Oh boy. And they were racing against a guy that was really good last time. The guy uh, who is maining Yaya Panda. It's gonna be a, a very interesting race to uh, to say the least. I think I'm gonna switch to the speed driving style. Just because we're racing on, uh, on Coco Park. It's not really useful to get the drift driving style there because there's no ultimate sacred fire. If you guys didn't know, drift um, lets you maintain the ultimate sacred fire easier or longer. So definitely go for the drift driving style if you have a track with blue fire. Oh boy, here we go. I gotta focus up because if I want to win another race in this episode, I gotta perform well. That guy with the uh, Yaya Panda is pretty good. Hopefully I don't... Okay then. Huh! I hit the wrong dude! I come on, why were you Oh man? Why did you do that, bro? Ah oh, well, that's already the end of the race, I guess. Oh, there we go. Okay. I'm still gonna go for that third place finish though, and I think I am gonna get it, because I don't think this guy is taking any uh any shortcuts? Oh yeah, he is. Okay. Interesting. Get out of here, bro! Now, if you have the uh, Sacred Fire, you can just skip this part. We're getting a little bit closer to that Yaya Panda, though. Okay, let's... Go for this uh, this route here again. Yeah, we're not gonna get it. Just because I got hit at the start of the race, man. It's so important. The start of every single race is just so important. There is no way to catch up anymore. Hey, at least I got second place, though. I'm alright with that. I just hit the wrong guy. <laughs> if only I hit that uh, waifu at the start of the race there with that bowling bomb. That, uh, it, it would still be close, but... I... I just hit another dude. <laughs> Unlucky. Oh, I am gonna get you, waifu. I am gonna get you. Or at least I'm gonna try to. Hopefully they won't kick us out of the lobby, because I wanna... I wanna have a best out of three with this guy, especially on Twilight Tour on Engine Labs. That is going to be a really, really tight race with that waifu guy. Hopefully he doesn't, uh, he doesn't leave, though, because... Oh, it is gonna be Twilight Tour. Come on. I know how to race this track. 
It is gonna be really, really intense. I am ready for it. Let's go. Also, something I wanted to ask you guys is which final skin do you like the most? Like, from which character do you really like the, uh, the final skins? Or the final skin? Let me know down below in the comment section. But for now, I am going to focus on getting this, uh, this first place victory. This is very important. He didn't get a... Um... Oh, come on! How did that... Oh, man, come on. Ah, oh. I thought I was going to hit him. Ah, oh, that, that would have been it, though. I think he's gonna have a, uh, a potion. Oh, he takes the shortcut as well. Now, I need to learn how to do that, too. Oh, if I can catch up a little bit. I have this rocket ready for, uh, for that guy. My rocket is ready for you, bro. I just need to catch up a little bit. But he's uh, he's gaining some ground on me. Ah. I thought I could hit him with a green potion, but I couldn't. Man, he's good. All right. Come on, man, just just mess up for once. Yeah, he's not messing up, right? Oh, even put a green potion there. Cheeky bastard! You cheeky, cheeky bastard! Oh, there's a warp orb coming! Oh my god. That could be it, though. Oh, no, that's not it. That is not it. I, I, oh, why did I do that? Come on! I was so focused on the minimap to see where the, uh, where the warp orb was. He's gonna... He's gonna... Oh! Oh my god! Oh no, he had the shield! Are you kidding me? Oh, well. Yep, that is the end. Best two out of three. Um, wife who actually won the, won the matchup. Well done, bro. And the freaking bot hit me. <laughs> wow. Okay, then. Oh, I just noticed there's someone with the, with the chick, um, Rustland chick um, skin as well. He got, like... 30 wins with Chick? Ah, dang, man. Well done. Ah. Why did I lose the blue flames and why did he have a, uh, have a shield? Again, it's all down to keeping the blue flames and getting getting items that can defend you against, against warp orbs or time clocks. He, well, GG though. He's definitely a better player. Alright, that's gonna be it for uh, this video though. Well done, waifu. You were uh, a very good opponent. I definitely need to improve my CTR skills. Now that I'm finally done with my exams, I can focus on getting better at CTR because that is one of the things I really want to do because I want to up my quality of the videos, especially the gameplay part. I think the commentary is all right. Maybe I talk a little bit too much during the races. I don't know if you guys like that or if I should shut up a little bit, uh, a little bit more during the races. Let me guys know down below in the comments as well as your opinions on this nightmare mega mix skin let me know down below in the comments as well and from now on I will do this for every single new character that's gonna be coming out if there's only going to be one character coming out with each Grand Prix if there's like three I am NOT going to do that because I already struggled with getting 20 to 25 wins with this uh, with this character I can't imagine the struggle when doing this for three separate characters that that that's that, that would be insane really Anyway, I'm gonna end the video here though. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like if you want to see more. Then subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video.